Hi, this is Tracy HD, and I want to thank you for joining me today for our July 2021 tarot reading, and this will be for the sign of Leo. As I shuffle the deck, I'm asking all light beings, angels, and God, please relay the message I need to share with my viewers, the highest good of all. At the beginning of the month, I'll take a card from the top. The middle of the month, I'm going to take a card from the center. At the end of the month, I'm going to take a card from the bottom. Okay, and let's see what we have here, Leo. So we begin the month with the Six of Wands. How beautiful is that? You're getting recognized for some hard work and effort that you've put in. This is a card of recognition, okay? People are going to recognize you for a job well done, okay? And it's a beautiful, beautiful uh person riding in on this horse and there's people behind him and he's out in front so this is something that maybe you've been working on and, and wanting to achieve for a long time and then finally you're being recognized for it okay and it's going to be different for all of you exactly what this means but what's happening here is you've put in the time and effort you've dedicated yourself to something and you've achieved it so this is a very good thing to happen in the beginning of the month because it really sets the tone for the rest of the month. So this could be a promotion at work, okay? And then in the middle of the month, we have the Fool. That's also a great card to get because the Fool is telling you to take a leap of faith. So maybe whatever you've been achieving here, being recognized for, you could take to the next level. Because the full could be an unexpected opportunity that just drops in your lap out of nowhere. Something that you don't even see coming. And it's asking you to take a leap of faith. So I'm thinking, you know, you might feel doubtful, you know, should I do it? Shouldn't I do it? Uh, do I have enough training? Do I have enough education? Am I going to be able to handle this? This card is telling you, just go for it, okay? Take that leap of faith. Nothing is ever a waste of time. As long as we've learned from it, even if you fail, you still learned. If you, you win and you're successful, that's great too. So whatever this is, be aware in the middle of the month that an opportunity is going to come by and you need to grab it. Because if you allow something like this to pass you by, it might be a once in a lifetime type of opportunity. And then at the end of the month, we have the Six of Cups. So at the end of the month, this could be somebody from your past returning. This could be someone you went to school with, maybe a childhood friend. It could be a past lover, okay, past partner. Um, or it could just be a feeling of, of being melancholy and, and looking back at the past. And, and that's fine to reminisce, okay, about things from the past. But we don't want to get caught up in this where we get so nostalgic that we're stuck in the past. Because when we're stuck in the past, we can't move forward. So this could be either the return of someone from your past, or it could be feeling melancholy and nostalgic and thinking about things of the past. So you're going to be feeling emotional at the end of the month. And so you want to make sure that you don't get stuck in the past. What a beautiful, beautiful month for you. Being recognized for your achievements, an opportunity coming your way that you want to grab that. You want to take that leap of faith. And then someone or something from the past coming back or feeling nostalgic. But make sure that you don't let this hold you back from moving forward. Very beautiful. If you've enjoyed this reading, please like it by giving it a thumbs up. Share it. And above all, subscribe because I will be back with more.